The following audio may contain the personal testimonials of some Optavia coaches or clients of Optavia. The results relayed in these messages are based on the unique experiences of the participants and we cannot guarantee like or similar outcomes. While you may be inspired by these accounts, please note that any stories of success have not been verified and your individual path to optimal health will vary. As always, it is our recommendation that you consult with a healthcare provider before starting a weight loss program. Yours in health, the Optavia team. Welcome everyone. I am so incredibly honored and excited to be your host for the next 30 minutes. My name is Donnie Alvarenga and I am a certified health coach. What can you expect from the next 30 minutes? You're gonna be hearing stories from mamas that represent families that have chosen to plan their life around what matters most to them. Now, all of the mamas that you're gonna be hearing from homeschool. However, homeschooling is not the point. The point is having the option to do, to be able to choose what's right for your family. Now, you may not be a mama, and you are absolutely welcome. We're excited to have you with us. You may not be a homeschooler, but you might be someone that would love to be able to put their kids in private school, or you might be someone that would love to put their kids in extracurricular activities, or you might not have kids, but you have people in your life and things in your life that you would like to plan your life around instead of planning it around a job schedule or you know imposed schedules. And so whichever area you're coming to us from, we wanna welcome you tonight. Now, the moms that share tonight are homeschooling moms. And I just wanna tell you a little bit about my, about my story. You know, I actually am a, um, I'm an Optavia, certif certified Optavia coach. And as fiercely proud as I am of that title, what I'm most excited about is the fact that it has given me the opportunity to be more of what I really wanted to be. Because if you asked me when I was little what I wanted to be when I grow up, I would have told you I wanna be a mom. <laughs> and I always also wished and dreamed of homeschooling someday. But in my mind, I thought that for me to have the freedom to homeschool, I would have to have the freedom to not be able to work, okay? But it turns out that as I grew up and you know, real life hit me in the face, it turns out that my, my family depended on my income and I started wondering if it would ever be possible for me to homeschool. And I went on and I became a nurse and a nurse practitioner and I enjoyed doing that. And I was able to provide for my family and in the process of all of that, I ended up gaining, well, first of all, I got pregnant with twins. So I got my dream and my wish of becoming a mom. But once I delivered those babies, I went on to gain 50 pounds over a nine month period of time. And that was not fun. But what happened was I connected with a coach that introduced me to this incredible system that made it simple for me to regain my health and lose 50 pounds and not only discover that I could be the mom that I wanted to be, but that I could do the homeschooling that I wanted to do. And so let me tell you a little bit about who we are. Octavia is a growing community of people who are ready to take personal responsibility for their optimal health. So that's a mouthful. The question is, what is optimal health? Well, we believe that optimal health is a sweet spot between a healthy body, healthy mind, and healthy finances. And we also believe that health does not come in a pill or a package or you know in any kind of container. It actually comes in our daily choices. So what we do is we actually help people change their habits one at a time so that we can create lifelong transformation. Now, when it comes to your health, how are you doing in terms of healthy mind? If you were to rate your, your health on, this, on a scale from one to 10, how are you doing in terms of healthy mind? That means that you have a feel, sense of purpose and meaning in what you spend your time doing. That means that you um, have the freedom to do the things that are important to you, whether that's community service or spend time with the people that you care most. That's the healthy mind piece. How are you doing? In terms of the healthy body piece, how would you rate yourself on a scale from one to 10? 
How happy are you with your current weight? If you ask your body to do something, will it do it? Will it say yes? On a scale from one to 10, how would you rate your health in terms of your finances? Do you feel like you have the ability to meet your needs and the demands that are on your you know, responsibilities? Um, do you feel like you have the resources to create memories? Well, here's a little nugget, a little you know, um, insight into what's happening in most of the country in terms of the physical health piece. What we know is that at least two thirds of Americans are either overweight or obese. And we also know that weight is at the root of many of the chronic diseases that drain healthcare dollars. And so we know that there is a big, big problem. And we also know that, like I mentioned before, that problem is not solved by a pill. And so what we do, as I mentioned earlier, is we help people create lifelong transformation in all of those arenas, one healthy habit at a time. And basically we do that by making it a little bit easier most of us know what we should be doing to be healthier. If, I mean, I would love for you to type into the chat some of the things that you know that you should be doing. We know what to do, but we don't always do what we know. And so what we do at Optavia is we offer people tools to make the process of doing what you know a little bit easier. Because if it's easy enough, then you'll do it. And if you do it consistently enough, you'll see results and you'll develop a habit. And a tool is an instrument that makes a job easier. Think about a hammer, right? Can you imagine trying to put a nail in the wall without a hammer? Yes, you can do it without a hammer, but it's probably gonna be a lot harder and it's gonna take you a lot longer. So these are some of the resources and tools that we use in our program. The first tool is the tool of accountability. You get a one-on-one -on -one coach that guides you and helps you clarify what it is that you want, and creates a plan with you and reminds you of what you wanted when sometimes life distracts you. And I call that the power of saving face. And I gotta tell you what, it was incredibly powerful in my own health journey. Then there's the tool of education. We have a habits of health system that addresses all of the habits of health from sleep to stress management, to nutrition, to activity, and it comes in the format of a book and a workbook. And every week we have our Habits of Health call. And what this system is in, designed to do is to empower you to become the expert on your own health. And that's the Habits of Health system. The third tool is the sense of community. And since we're in the business of helping people retrain their habits and develop a new way of living, then it's important that we understand what influences human behavior. And nothing influences human behavior more than human behavior. And so the people that we surround ourselves with, they determine our outcome. You know, here we're talking with some homeschooling mamas. If you are a parent, put into the chat if you ever are concerned about who your children are hanging out with, right? And that's because we know that the people that we spend the most time with, they're the ones that are gonna determine our outcome. And so we leverage the power of peer pressure in your favor by plugging you in with an incredible community of support. I like to call it vitamin C, you know, because vitamin C actually boosts your immunity when it comes to infections and disease. Well, community or vitamin C boosts your immunity against discouragement and complacency. And so that's the third tool, some vitamin C. The fourth tool is the simplicity factor when it comes to healthy eating. Because the truth of the matter is, is that people become overwhelmed when they think of how complicated it's supposed to be to be healthy. And I don't know if you've ever heard this before, but that one of the healthy way to, ways to eat is to eat frequent small meals. So the idea of planning five or six meals a day oftentimes overwhelms people to the point where they become paralyzed. So what we do is we make that whole process simple by utilizing fuelings that are scientifically formulated to make sure that you're getting adequate nutrition no matter what stage of your health journey you're at. Now, there is another tool. The fifth tool is the tool of you using this system to help someone else as a coach. And when you do that, what that does is it reinforces your own commitment to be healthy. I've heard before that you get to keep only what you give away. 
And we package this in a beautiful way with a bow on top so that you can give it away. And you're gonna be hearing from some people that did give this gift away and how it has impacted their own health. Now, it's as incredibly rewarding as it is to give this, the gift of health away. Let me tell you what, it's fun. And there's some compensation involved, not only in terms of the cash, but also in the currency of feel good. And both of those create for a very fulfilling life. And it gives you the opportunity to leave a legacy. So a li let me ask you this, why would you want to partner with Octavia? Well, the reason is because we have a pretty good track record. We've got a really amazing reputation. Our parent company has been a leader in health and wellness programs and plans for almost 40 years. We are a New York stock exchange company and we have been ranked as one of the top most trustworthy companies by Forbes, both in 2016 and 2017. So our track record speaks for itself. I'm really excited to introduce you to Shelly Hank. She is a fellow homeschooling mama. She's been homeschooling for about 13 years. And I'm gonna let her come on and share with you a little bit about how health, how health coaching has impacted her family's ability to plan their life around what matters most to them. Thanks for joining us tonight, Shelly. Thanks for having me, Donnie. So tell us a little bit about your journey to coaching. My journey to coaching um, starts with um, my journey to nursing. <laughs> Um, I'm a nurse and I've uh, been working as a nurse throughout my homeschooling uh, journey and I just kind of found a way to mesh those two things together, which was crazy and stressful, but we made it work. Um, but I, you know, listening to the problems that we have in our culture with chronic disease, it just broke my heart. Um, I got into the business of nursing to help people, and I just done, did not feel like I was helping people the way that I wanted to, um, and I began to um, explore the idea of coaching, and so I did go to school to be a uh, coach and uh, got certified as a whole health educator and um, a certified health coach um, through a program for nurses, and then I um, was really looking for a way to do it more simply. Um, and that's when I found Optivia. Um, I think as homeschool moms, we're always looking for ways to do things simpler and better and <laughs> faster because, you know, our time is precious. And although we really did want to help people with their health, I also really wanted to design my life around what mattered most to me. And um, I knew that, um, this system, when I was introduced to it, was very comprehensive and had a lot of the components that I was taught in coaching school. Um, so I began to uh, become a certified Octavia coach. Of course, I was a client before I was a coach, and I did experience a physical uh, transformation, as you can see here in the pictures. Um, and I would have considered myself somebody who was healthy before, um, but I was actually, even as a whole health educator, eating organic um, whole foods and you know um, living a very healthy lifestyle I was able to transform my health um, and to just to bring it to a higher level than what it was before I had both my baby c-section and realized that you know my I didn't think my belly would ever be flat again <laughs> but you can see in the pictures it's flat now so that was total win. Um, you know, the, the healthy mind piece for me has been huge because as you can imagine, um, working as a nurse and uh, a mom who's homeschooling was very stressful. Nights, weekends, holidays, you know, I always felt like I was trading um, time with my kids for money. Um, I had to leave the house to work the 12-hour shifts, and you know, a lot of times things fall through the crack when you're doing that. All homeschooling moms can tell you that something's got to give somewhere, right? And then, um, you know, coaching just really has helped to transform our lives financially because, um, you know, although I was making money as a nurse, um, I was not what I would call financially free. Um, it was always how little can I work just enough to pay the bills and keep things going in the right direction. There was never extra. And of course, when there's never extra, that means that you are not doing anything extra, right? You're, 
you have to be the no mom all the time. You know, no, we can't do the fun thing. No, we can't go on vacation. No, we can't get this. And that broke my heart. Um, I wanted to be able to be at home with my kids and I wanted to be able to say yes every now and then. And that's helped us to coaching has actually helped us to, to do that. And now I get to be the mom that says yes. Um, here in the picture at the bottom is the picture of my daughter and uh, me at the beach. We went to the beach last week. Um, how's that for um, homeschooling and, you know, learning, right? You get to go to the beach. Um, but, you know, one of the things that um, has blessed me so much is to give the gift of coaching away. Um, and what that was something that I love the most about the Optivia system was that I knew that I wasn't doing it alone and I was doing it in community. A lot of us as homeschoolers, we belong to homeschool co-ops and, um, you know, that's part of the, the homeschool culture, right? You wanted to have a little community, right? And this gave me a chance to have a little community of my own of health um, with people who are learning and the lead learners, right? And so we have a comprehensive program to help to give the coaching gift away and to train other people to coach. Um, so it's a comprehensive training system. You learn as you earn. You work with a business coach and a mentorship team. We employ team coaching so that you're, you apprenticeship and you grow with right along with your mentor coach. Um, you work at your own pace and it's, um, you know, optional local, regional and national wellness and training events are offered. And I want to introduce you to the first person that I could not wait to give coaching away to um, because this is my best friend in the whole wide world. Um, she is a homeschooling mama of six. We actually met homeschooling um, at a co-op for um, PE, and we've been inseparable ever since. And I knew the struggles that she had in her body, her mind, and her finances. And I thought, I want to give this away. She's not a nurse. She's not a coach. She's not a holistic health coach or educator or any of that stuff. But with our comprehensive system, I was able to bring her into the Optivia community and plug her into our comprehensive program. And I want her to tell you how it's changed her, her life. Thank you so much. And thank you for the invitation to share about my homeschooling and coaching journey. So as you can see, um, I did lose a little bit of weight in the beginning, and I'm so blessed to have been able to do that. But um, the greatest part of what I got to do is um, feel better. You know, I just didn't feel good. I was tired and fatigued. As you can see, I have five kids in this picture because I still have five of my six kids at home and I'm still teaching four of them. And you're doing a lot of running. We have a lot of activities. I tried to say yes to a lot of the free stuff <laughs> in the co-ops and the communities that we could be involved in and we play a lot of sports. So in the meantime of being on the go all the time, I did put on some weight and uh, really didn't feel like I had the energy to chase them as well as I used to. I was relying on my older ones more often than I really wanted to and I didn't feel like I was able to stay awake at night often to read a book to my little one. So they were sometimes, you know, filling in for me because I was working part-time and full-time throughout our entire 19 years so far of, of homeschooling. And um, it made it difficult to really invest the kind of time that I wanted to invest in my family. And so what Shelly really saw was not only was I struggling my weight, I was feeling, you know, just depressed and I am not a depressed person. I am very positive and optimistic in my life. And I was just feeling overwhelmed with my, you know, emotions and she was able to come alongside me, work with me step by step on the client side of things, help me gain my health back and empower me to take control of my health. And then um, help me continue on that journey to transition and um, make better choices, not just for me, but for my family. So in my body, I was able to transition. And in my mind, I was able to think more clearly, have more energy, give more value to the people around me, and feel fully present in my family's life. She also knew that working part-time, I was definitely not able to um, help me make, help make my my financial needs and my family met. And 
this was really a great opportunity that she shared with me to be able to boost our finances to raise all these babies and help them to do fun things. So yeah, it's been pretty amazing to have this opportunity to build relationships, come alongside people, especially other moms. That's where my heart is, is to come alongside other moms just like me who are struggling in their health, who are struggling to keep it together and who are struggling to, you know, keep the bills paid. And not only now can we keep our bills paid, but we can pay them off and we can do fun things and we can feel excited about planning and creating memories together. And isn't that what we want? We just want to live our lives and integrate our families and create memories together. So now instead of being the queen of convenience all the time in my eating, <laughs> I can be, you know, present with my family all the time. And I love that. I love that, Brandy. And what I love is how friends don't let friends, friends don't leave friends behind. And I'm excited to introduce you to Joanna because Joanna, a friend of yours, did not allow you to be left behind as well. Is that correct? That is very correct, Donnie. And I am so excited to share my story with you guys tonight. So um, I am a mama of six, as you can see. And I like Donnie had a dream of just being a mom one day. Um, part because I love kids, but part because somewhere along in my life, I started believing the lie that that was the only thing I could do. Now, don't get me wrong. I believe motherhood is one of my highest callings, but I don't believe it's my only calling now. But somewhere along the way, I started believing that was all I was cut out for. So I got married at 22, was pregnant six weeks later. We had our first son, and then we just kept having more babies. We couldn't figure out what caused it. And so we had a love for children and we just, and then we adopted. Um, and I had a des deep desire to homeschool my children because I wanted to create a, a community within my own family. And so I started homeschooling them. So here's what you need to know. In this whole process, my husband was a pastor, he was in ministry, but he got really, really sick. Um, he had, was on disability and there were many, many nights that I laid awake wondering, what are we going to do if he can never work again? How are we going to survive? And it was absolute turmoil because at this point, I was a professional mother. I was a professional homeschooler and I did not have any skill sets, I believed, outside of that. Um, Meanwhile, in the process of all this, I definitely ate my weight in Ben and Jerry's. I was having a significant affair <laughs> with Ben and Jerry. And um, my best friend was completely melting away before my eyes, Leslie Begin. Um, but what impressed me most about her transformation was the woman that emerged in the process. This woman got her sexy back. This woman had um, a, a demeanor about her that was doggone it, I conquered this, I could do anything. She was on fire, I wanted that, that's what I wanted. And so we talked about what it was gonna take and she said to me, you know, Joanna, you really do need to lose weight as a best friend can only do, but you know what? You guys need to figure out a way how you're gonna make money because if Jay can't work again, what are you gonna do? So this is gonna work for you, she said, and you need to start coaching. And I was like, okay whatever you say. So lo and behold, I lost, gosh, 38 pounds and like 12, I don't know, something crazy. I lost a lot of weight and I was so proud and so on fire for what was happening in my body. I wanted everyone I wanted everyone to experience what I was experiencing. I wanted everyone to know you are made for more. So I decided to start coaching. Well, guess what? In the process, my husband went through all this brain surgery. It had like this, had his vestibular assist, uh, system removed, learned how to walk again. And he decided he wanted to go back to medicine. He wanted to move into medicine. So now this homeschooling mama of six kids now became the sole provider for our family while my husband was going to school. So we moved into this new season. We moved into a season where he was, um, in school and I was building this business. And let me be honest with you, there were moments where it was just messy. It was messy and I had to learn new skills. I had to learn about time blocking. I had to learn a different type of perseverance. 
I had to say no to some things because I was saying yes to something else. Somewhere in the process, I started believing some new lies. I can't wait till my husband is done with school so I can just go back to being a mom. I almost started resenting Octavia a little bit. What I realized though, I really wasn't resenting Octavia. I was resenting the growth. Octavia put me in a position where it was time for me to become more. Optavia put me in a position where it's a time for me to learn new skill sets, to be, learn how to be a present mom when it was time for me to, me to be mom, and how to be a present coach when it was time to be coach. Optavia gave me a place where I could have influence, where we could earn income, where we could um, impact other lives, and it scared scared the bedonkers out of me. It wasn't that Optavia was the issue, it was that I had growth to do. And thank goodness for Optavia that I was given a space to start growing. So now I'm in it for the long game, man. I'm here. I love coaching. I love coming alongside people and getting to be part of their transformation. I love being able to, it's intoxicating to be able to watch people come alive and their lives change. And yes, I get to be a yes mom. Yes, I get to buy six pairs of shoes all at once for all my children. Who knew that would be so exhilarating, right? I get to, we got to take our family on a three-month trip backpack, or excuse me, camping throughout the country. Y'all, that's freedom. That's time freedom. That's education freedom. That's financial freedom. So many things that I had always dreamed about that never thought was possible has come to fruition because we decided to say yes to coaching and decided to say yes to growth. And what I love about our progressive growth model is that you will never do this alone. You will never grow at a pace that you are not comfortable with, and you will always have someone walking with you through each stage. We have the Optavia coach. When you come in, you become a coach of other clients and your coach will work with you and develop you and walk with you in how to coach clients. And as you become passionate and love this, you get to start coaching other coaches and training other coaches. Then you become a business coach. Who knew I could be a business coach? Yes, you can be a business coach, but there's more. As you start loving coaching coaches and learning how to, and I mean, you know, all it is is awakening people. It's awakening and supporting clients. It's awakening and supporting coaches. And you get to walk with people, walk with people in that. And as you do it more and more and develop more skills, you get to move into leadership. Oh my goodness, yes, you are a leader. If you are someone who loves to come alongside people, you are a leader. And let me share with you how it works because this is what's so fun it's relational it's easy it's relational our our entire focus is well-being when you say yes to stepping into being a coach you say yes to our full offering you say yes to finding a space where you are going to have more accountability you say yes to finding a space where you are going to have um people around you Surrounding you are passionate and on fire about becoming the best versions of themselves and equipping other people to do the same. You say yes to, to learning how to develop time freedom and financial freedom. And it gets even more exciting because you're self-employed. So you create your hours. You get to create and develop your life around what matters most most rather than trading dollars for money as I think um, or money for hours or hours for dollars as Shelly said earlier you don't have to trade that you get to create the life you want you get to be pulled full-time or part-time I started out as very part-time and now I am full-time which sometimes makes me laugh because I'm really only part-time but that's regardless I mean I'm full-time for me and now my husband joined us. He's a PA and he says he's a full-time coach and a part-time PA. The investment in this, don't even get me started on the investment. You get to own your own business with a minimal startup cost. And we have no, almost no operating costs and no inventory. In fact, we don't want you to have inventory. You get to create your own hours. Um, I have learned the art of time blocking. I have learned to create business hours. I've learned that there's no emergencies in health coaching. So when I am health coach, I'm health coach. When I'm mom, I'm mom. Not every now and then they cross over, but it's okay. I can be a swim team practice doing calls. 
That's fun. That's freedom. I can be on a field trip with my children whenever I want. I can sit with a friend who's struggling because I get to develop and shape my life around what matters most to me. And I love this because I hear people say this to me all the time. I don't want to sell things. I don't like to sell. And I'm like, doggone it, that's awesome. Because please don't. Don't sell things. You are not going to be selling things. You are going to be loving people well. You are going to be living your life out loud. There are no quotas. There's no monthly purchases required. And you will be surrounded by a team of people who are going to support you and train you, empower you, and equip you to become the best versions of yourself and the best coach possible. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much. Oh, my goodness. Joanna, Brandy, Shelly. Um, that was amazing. And I think that offers you, as you're watching, a glimpse of what it means to plan your life around what matters most to you. And what Optavia does is it simply offers you a vehicle to do that. And tonight, we invite you to join our mission. We are on a mission to help get America and then the world healthy. And we want to start with you. At whatever aspect of optimal health, you're looking to improve first, whether it's the body, the mind, or the finances. But really, we invite you to explore and experience all of it. Because if you ask any of these mamas, they will tell you it's amazing. So thank you so much for joining us tonight. We invite you to reach back out to the person that invited you to join us tonight to learn a little bit more about what your next steps might be. Have a good night, guys. This audio may have contained the personal testimonials of some Optavia coaches or clients of Optavia. The results relayed in these messages are based on the unique experiences of the participants, and we cannot guarantee like or similar outcomes. While you may be inspired by these accounts, please note that any stories of success have not been verified and your individual path to optimal health will vary. As always, it is our recommendation that you consult with a healthcare provider before starting a weight loss program. Yours in health, the Optavia team.